Hey everybody, PC Outcast here, back with more of the Bronze Sentinel, or the, uh, currently the Imperial Sentinel, I guess. So, yeah, I did, uh, a whole bunch of mining at Ember Shard, and the result is 26 Iron Daggers, and, uh, smithing at level 19. So, we're going to sell those off. I don't claim to be the best looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Take all of these, please. Thank you. And I'll keep those, I guess. And, um, yeah, the only change is mod-wise is that I did install Violins, as I mentioned in the last episode, and turned off player uh, kill can't, like, kill, that kill moves can't be performed on me. Uh, and I also changed lock overhaul so that I will gain experience when I bash things, as recommended in the comments. So thank you very much for that. Now, um, I guess there's no point in me actually going out here. So we need to get to level 10, pretty much. We're getting close to level 5. Our next goal is level 10. So I think we're going to go... Um, along here, like we said. Ba kind of hit things along here and maybe make our way... I'm thinking we make our way down to um, to the uh, Elemental Fury uh, thing there. I think the Elemental Fury word wall would be a good a good option. Is it? El it's Elemental Fury that's there, right? I think. I'm pretty sure. Oh, of course, it's nighttime. We're gonna be uh, gonna be running through here at night. Uh, maybe I will uh, pass time so you guys can. Wow, well, that's really nice. So you guys can actually see something instead of us constantly running around in the darkness. Yeah, so first stop is the bandit camp up here. Then I guess we'll go loot the uh, Talus Shrine. And uh, then we'll see. Yeah, I want to make my way down to where that conjurer is, Necromancer or whatever, and kill them with pure magic. Kindly. Ow. Oh yeah, get wrecked. Uh, you know, playing with this armor set makes me want to do, uh, is it Ponty? I think Ponty did a, like a bad, a bad Legionnaire type character. Um, yeah, so I'll take that. Treasure map, sure, we might look that up. Yeah, I think it was Ponty that... What is going on? What is going on with my... Why, why is this not on my favorites anymore? Hello? Weirdness. Um, sure. One handed, very nice.
Sometimes there's a spider here. Apparently not today. Okay, let's level up. And uh, more health. Next one we can put into stamina. Uh, I can actually put the point into there, but that's not really going to do me much good. Yeah, we want that. Block. Could go up to 25%. Kind of not uh, useful at the moment. Heavy armor might not be a bad idea. Uh, restoration. No, I can't do anything more there right now. Destruction. Let's do that. Clearly as a machine, I have no sympathy or morals or anything like that. Uh, can't use that. Probably be struck down by by uh, Talos himself in a minute. <laughs> uh, yes, I did just do that. Don't question it. Well, isn't that a lovely placid lake evening scene? Yeah, I think we all need a little deck right here. A little, I mean a dock, a little dock right here. Sit out on the lake, that would be so nice. Forget about being cooped up in tiny apartments and stuff. This, this is how life is meant to be. Okay. Now let's see. We're going to do this. Let's see how it works. So she should. She's going to. Um, oh, nice. It actually uh, knocks you off your feet. That's, that's kind of cool. <laughs> she couldn't actually do anything. Just kept stun locking her with her own uh, her own ward. Um, that's actually worth quite a bit. All right. Well, that went very well. Foundation not particularly useful. Is that a, is that a coin? That is a coin, and I can't I can't take it. I don't think there's anything else of interest there. That was kind of cool, though. Do I have everything equipped again? Yeah. Alright, Wolf. Let's make this happen, you and I. Well, you three and I. Where's the other one? Bash! Um, oops. Nice. Did I catch any diseases from that? No. Good, good. So let's see, we're gonna kind of take on, you know, I, I think I might go into the entrance to, I um, can't remember what it's called, but there's a vampire up here in a crypt. And I'm thinking I might go and uh, I might go in and just see about killing her with magic as well. Is there anybody here? Sometimes there is. Yeah, what do 
whatever this place is called. Um, I think I should probably deal with these these uh, skeletons over here first, though, assuming they are here. Yep, there we go. Show yourself, skeleton. So funny how uh, skeletons are like so deadly in uh, in Morrowind and Oblivion, and they are so weak in Skyrim. So, uh, yeah. Vampire. Nope. Let's do this again. We'll try that, see how it works out. Oh, vampire lady. Would you like some fire? Oh. That went rather quickly. Um, sure. Okay, didn't... Didn't catch uh, vampirism, which is good. <laughs> that would kind of put a bit of a crimp in our plans. All those. Not that I really need. Well, filled soul gems is probably useful. Now there should be these things. Roast some dinner up. Man, I wish you could do that. Is there a mod? Does anybody know if there's a mod for that? It allows you to, like, cook animals with fire spells? That would be awesome. Um, weak poison, version of fire. The version of fire is actually not a completely horrible idea. I wasn't going to go through this place, because there is a master vampire in here, I think, right? I'm pretty sure there is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. What is this place? Shriekwind Bay Bastion. Yeah, there's de there's definitely a master vampire at the end of this. Is even with fire aversion, I don't think that's gonna end very well for us. Fire aversion poisons and everything. Probably not enough. But we did kill the fledgling vampire, which is. Um, Impressive in and of itself, because that is sometimes... That can be difficult for some characters. Okay, so I think we're going to try taking on this necromancer in the tower. Now, she is tougher than the conjurer that we dealt with. And... But she's... Depending on the character, she can be kind of on a par, more or less, with that vampire that we just dealt with, so we'll see. We shall see. I'll save it. I'll save it right here, actually. If it doesn't go well, then we will uh, not do that. Sometimes there's... Oh, there's... What, what do we got over here? Wolves? Oh. Give me your 
help. Where's your friend? Right. All right. I really don't like. I don't like fight. It's funny. I don't like fighting in in um, third person unless it's a two-handed weapon. Call me crazy. That's fine. Necromancer. There you are. Oh, you're only level one. Uh, how come you're not? Your thing isn't breaking. Focus on her. Oh, well. Close, but no. Yeah, so her ward was staying up, which is kind of interesting. Hmm. I'm not sure why her ward was staying up. Now, now we're now, now we're not talking. Okay. Now, I regenerate Magica off of you. Oh yeah, regenerating Magica off of her <laughs> casting. You know, two people can do that, and I've got a bigger sword than you do. That was more like it. Use the right keys. Another conjuration skill book, which is kind of not useful. Uh, can I take this? Without burning myself, preferably. And there you are. Uh, necromancer robes, I guess. Okay. Cool. Um, yeah. Is there a mat? Can I... Yeah. We're gonna just, just gonna sleep until then. Nearly eight. Should be good. Should be very good. Ah, so much better. Okay. Yeah, that works. That works pretty well. So you use their magic to basically power your healing spell. And then, uh, oops. Mm. When am I going to actually come across another thing to fight? Yeah, you use their magic to power your healing and your fire. It doesn't always work, of course, and later on when you have higher... Um, the higher your magic absorption is, the less of a threat that is. Eventually, we'll be just massacring. Although, I guess we've we did just ma kind of massacre three mages. She took us down once, but an adjustment of tactics was required. But anyway, yeah. Later on, mages will just pose no threat whatsoever. I mean, they'll only be able to do do damage to us 10% of the time, and we will be doing damage to them 100% of the time. We can also swap out more powerful spells. I think we're going to end up using uh, Fireball and 
Um, ignite. Yeah, I'm not sure if there's much. I don't think there's much along here, to be honest. We might come across, like, a wolf or something down at the crossroads. Oh, know that, we're nearly at six. Making progress, even without a uh, a mod to increase our the, the you know the rate that we generate experience. It's one of the things that that's that's one of the big things actually is um, experience. The ability to gain experience more quickly with a mod that's that's one of the big reasons that i uh, prefer to do builds in skyrim than eso like i had a lot of fun playing eso and um i did do a few builds for it but it takes so much time to put together a build in eso i mean what you can do, I know quite a few ESO YouTubers do this, is they um, they create like sort of templates, right? They've got their their necromancer and their um, templar and um, you know I can't even remember all the classes now. <laughs> their wardens and so so on. So they they make that for the current. Um, the current patch and then when the next patch comes out they just update a few things maybe change out uh, a weapon or an armor set an armor piece or the armor set they're using maybe change around the use of you know certain skills and stuff depending on oh, grief get it in my way elk um yeah they'll just kind of change things around a little bit but it's still you know, they're still using that character that they had before, so they don't have to redo everything. And in that way, like, if you have sort of all the classes and more or less the way you want to do it, you can, re you know, you can just respec and change things around a little bit if you want. And there you go. You got, you can update, you know, post another... Oh, right. Uh, you can post another thing, but with Skyrim, because of, you know, being able to do console commands to give yourself gear and to, uh, use experience mods and stuff like that, you're allowed to, oh, you're able to do a lot more builds, explore a lot, like, radically different builds, uh, well, in a lot shorter time, so... One of the things that I do like about Skyrim, even as old as it is, and you know, obviously it's it's declining gradually and in, in um, popularity, but it's still here. Hopefully, Elder Scrolls Six won't suck, and we'll be able to do the same thing in that. Is there another wolf around here? Nope. Maybe. Not sure. Didn't see it, but I think there sometimes is. Oh, good grief. Maybe I should have done some more fighting around uh, Falkreath and then ended the episode and just done all this traveling by myself. Somebody is running over there, is there? Oh, it's kids. Okay. No, don't kill the children. That would not be... That would not be good. No lolling. 
jogging. I'm literally jogging through town in heavy armor. Do, does that seem like a lollygagger to you? Did I gain a level yet? No. Okay, we're going to end up with a little more stamina next time because we're doing uh, four health to one stamina. Not exactly a massive amount of stamina, but with some of the gear, uh, we will have a, a decent pool. Not enough to do, like, pretty, pretty steady amount of uh, shield bashing and power attacks. Hey, guys. See, it's, it's easy to die. It's not so easy to live, though, is it, friend? Gain a level. Nice. I guess. Hey, his body stayed put. Nice. Eh, I'm gonna. I gotta stop picking up lockpicks. That's just force of habit. I mean, yes, technically it weighs nothing. That's worth two, but. Eh. Alright, fine. Can't just leave it there. Now I can't leave these either. I'll take that too. Good enough, good enough. Let's move on. All right, so robbers, is it robbers gulch? Something like that, right? Robbers gorge, robbers, robbers something. There's a lot of guys there, and I, mm, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to take on the, uh, the chief. But I should be able to kill enough of the sort of outside guys to just get by at least. I think I just absorbed, um, I think I just absorbed disease. That was that, uh, magic. <laughs> ah, yes. Physics. I think that's what that, uh, what that shimmering was, magical shimmering around us. level. Stamina. And, um, no. Nothing in destruction. No. No. Heavy armor. I don't really want to go through here. I'm gonna 
and irritate them all at once. So I'm going to go over this way. No problem for a machine to swim through in heavy armor. That is not a problem. Oh, did I just walk on a... Here. Oh, come on. No, no, no. You come over here. Did you... You activated it and didn't... How can you stand there with zero health? I really would like to know that. Too bad these can't be sold. Value one, but... Not in the eyes of merchants. Ow. Ugh, really? A level one bandit that I can't stagger? Actually mean to pick that up, but sure. Okay, now what? What do we? What do we got here? Uh, that is a regular bandit. Okay, and we want. Um, you can heal me up, thank you very much. Okay, that works. Oh, don't fall off there, and I gotta go chasing your body down for loot. No, no, there you go. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna have much luck um, taking on a bandit chief. Am I? Mages are not a problem. Hey, chiefy. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm really, re oh, there we go. Don't run. Bandit chief down. Um, sure. Wow, that was unexpected. Cool. Um, no. Well, yes. Let me just take all of that. And I'm not going to bother going to loot the um, the island. That's fine. Let's just see. 
Alright, that's good. A little bit of money. Most importantly, we defeated everybody. That was really cool. Uh, anything else around here? Black robes? No. No. All right. Cool. Surprising. Shocking, even. Oh. One guy left. He's literally just hanging out over here while his buddies are all being burnt and beaten. Those kill cams, though. Uh, yeah, I can still carry that. Just. Oh, yeah. I'll check those guys. Corpse out for anything. I guess that. That is. That is all we can carry, really. Hmm. We're gaining levels pretty well, actually, so far. It's good to use a sort of a bit of a mix of skills like this because you can uh, gain levels a little quicker. How are things going in that regard? Uh, 21 there, so we could get the second perk there. We got uh, 20 in blocks, we can get the second one there. We uh, still haven't taken anything in one handed yet. I wanted to kind of maximize my my uh, especially my block skill before leveling up you know if, if you kill things too quickly then you don't level up block as well destruction is gonna be a while quite a while restoration too so yeah we're not gonna be getting a whole lot oh hello we're not gonna be putting a lot of perks into things Imperial business. Be on your way. Yeah. It's fine. Actually, you know what? Stop subjecting you guys to me just running over there. I don't think there's anything more. I don't think I'm going to fight anything else between here and uh, the word wall. So we will leave this episode here and we'll pick it up there. So thank you very much for joining me. We will see you in the next one.